Good morning guys. What a beautiful day it is. The sun is shining. But it must be about 22, 23 degrees already. It's now about half past 10. Quarter 11 time, something like that. Um, I'm now going for a short ride. I'm actually just going up with mother-in-law's because we decided we're going to have some burgers for dinner in the garden. Why not, eh? This weather. So we're going up to get that ready. And the reason for this video is, this morning, I gave Phoebe a clean. I don't know if you can see out the window. Look how shiny the bonnet is. Yeah, Phoebe done always get cleaned because obviously she's an everyday car you get one or two washes now and again when I can be bothered you know if, if she get bird crap all over or something I'll probably give it a wash usually we'd visit probably a car show or two or an event steam rally or something so I normally give her a darn good clean before that but as I haven't been any she didn't even have them. So this morning I thought, well I did say the other day, she's starting to look a bit grubby. The paint was actually fading. So I thought I'd give her a bit of a teacup. It's not the best job I could have done. I could have spent far more hours, but one reason I wanted to get it done before the sun got up like this, there's no shade in the side of my eyes. And also, I was just looking at a car, number plate, Zoe, my granddaughter, she'd like that. I say she'd like it. She ain't old enough to drive yet. Anyway, what was I saying? Yeah, so, um, I'll give it a quick going over. I guess if I just spend a couple more hours, I could have got it much better. But like I say, Phoebe's an everyday car, so she looks presentable now. In fact, she looks quite nice, nice and shiny. So I'll just cut now to that video of cleaning the car. Oh, before I go, I moved the um, speedo down here thinking that probably won't work and it is working but I need to order a cable I haven't done yet anyway so here's the video of cleaning the car right as I said the other day I'm gonna give Phoebe a bit of a clean if you look at the roof you can see that's a little bit shiny there very dull here and up these sides doors are not too bad but I've been giving it a bit of a clean I gave it a wash down last night and made a start yesterday afternoon until it got too hot I've done this side and look at that bonnet shiny now I had a pretty bad patch here that had faded quite badly where it sits in the sun over by that tree where I park but as you can see managed to get out with a bit of tea cut. I ain't spent too long because well I just get bored with it all. Um, I went up this pillar here stopped here as you can see so today I hope to get the roof done before that sun gets round this building and that'll be too hot here so I'm gonna crack on with that now. Right then guys you can see the roof is getting shiny now it's been tea cutting like I said, I did this side last night. I've been doing the roof. Did the bonnet, the front wings. This side's not too bad, because I guess the sun don't get it so bad, being this way round, like the other side and the roof. If you look here on the roof, um, this is obviously where I've done with a tea cut. And this side, where it's faded, is where I haven't done. There's still a little bit of a blemish there. Might have even been some bird crap on there for a long time. Now, 
Let's get on the ladder. Now if you look, this is obviously where I've just touched it with this glove, but um, it's got most of the blemishes out and I took like a thin layer off where it's oxidised like it has here and made it back shiny. But the sun's now coming up as you can see over the house so I want to quickly get this section finished and then give it a quick polish with some decent polish. I did the bonnet and the wings, I'll just do the roof just to make it last a bit longer really. Protect it, like I say. Um, it's not too bad on this side, so that might do it. I'm happy with that. Started to look quite decent again, isn't it? Right, let's get that done, get the polish on. There we go. Finished. All I need to do now is put a quick coat of polish all over it. She'll be fine. If you look down here, these um, rags I've been using, I did use another one but I threw it away earlier. But look, you can see how the dirt and the paint comes off the car. Just a thin layer. Cool, let's get some polish on it. Right then, so there it is. Phoebe's finished. Nice shiny roof. Not bad for an everyday car. I don't normally clean Phoebe very much to be honest. Usually I might give her a clean if we're going to a car show or something like that, an event. But as we haven't been to any for the last God knows how many months, then she ain't really had a polish up. Like I say, it's an everyday car. I'd probably get a wash two or three times a year if she's lucky. But she can clean up quite nice. Pleased with that roof. That was in a bit of a state, wasn't it? So, not much else I can say about it now. So, I'll call this the end of the video. Just a short one today of seeing how Phoebe cleans up. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button for more videos of Owen Phoebe and any maintenance we might be doing. I'll catch you guys soon. Bye for now.